This is Sparta! Not a bad map. Go up here to the center and see what we got. Hopefully these guys don't scare everybody off before I get there. With the gun depression I got, it should be a pretty nasty little corner. You can run, but you can't hide. Can't beat the reload of a badger. Somebody can see me, and I'm not a fan. Uh, I like things to be on an even playing field. Me see them, they see me. I don't like being seen, but not see. Just go a little further, and there they are. Are you this? AMX. IS3. If they had just left that IS3 alone, I could have absolutely wrecked him. Of course, that nice little ding everybody gets when I actually start looking at them is amazing. I love that. Guy's not even looking in my direction, but knows exactly when I start looking at him. I wish they'd get rid of that. Yeah. Bounce off the side of a freaking IS-3. What is this guy on the side of a freaking cliff or what? How? How is that a thing? How can I literally shoot into the butt of a freaking tank and do no damage at all? Nothing. 123 millimeter armor piercing round through the butt of a tank. No damage.
And that's how you deal with two tanks trying to outflank you on a tank destroyer. You don't need to cap this fight yet. Go straight up here. Catch this guy when he comes through. Of course. I really don't want to turn my back to a medium. And there it is. Dang it. It's an auto loader. Hey, uh, can somebody shoot this T-69 that's behind me on the ridgeline? I'll get up here and try to help with the base. I just don't want an auto-loading medium behind me. And of course they started capping our base. Alright, time to commit. And of course, that fucker's gonna shoot me in the ass 60 times because two guys on the other side of the fucking map can't fucking shoot anything! Anytime anybody would like to help would be preferable. Taking a shot at anything at this point would be nice. Preferably the autoloader that's got my ass. Okay, and that's the shot that bounces. Fuck off. Thanks for the fucking help, heavy tank. I appreciate it. Just keep sitting up there. Don't shoot the fucker. Don't move. Don't use your mobility. Appreciate it. God darn it, man. Really? One fucking job. Can't get anybody to fucking shoot the fucking medium tank tier 8 autoloader. I can fucking handle everybody else, but that guy sat on my ass for two fucking reloads. And not a single fucking shot. So you're not going to use your mobility to go back towards the base, pick off the one guy that's at the base. You're not going to use your mobility to shoot at the guys that are on your left. Come on, man. You got to do something. Freaking impressive. Complete waste of time. Death Star, you've got the T-69 behind you. Pull around the corner. And of course the heavy tank can't shoot him because he's turned around going the other direction. And we just lost the match and game over. GG, heavy tank. Indecisiveness killed us. Forty-six hundred block, thirty-two hundred damage, twelve hundred assisted. AMX 50 100, one of the best auto loaders in the game. Thousand damage. Survives. <sighs>
you gotta love it. Kelts or not, man, you gotta you gotta use your tank. Why sit? Oh well. Well, you know what? I think I'll throw that one up there for uh, all you salty Spartan guys. So uh, hope you enjoyed. It's not the best game in the world. Uh, it wasn't overly salty. Um, I knew I shouldn't have let that freaking guy stay on my butt because can't get any help from teammates, obviously. You know. And I know there's some of you guys will be like, "Well, Spartan, you're the one that turned around to try to do something." Yeah, I know. I know. I know all about it. But you know. You got an auto-loading heavy tank sitting on a freaking ridge line across the map from you, but he doesn't take a single shot at the T-69 because he's in a bad position. And uh, he doesn't use his mobility, which that tank does have to do anything. He just sat there while this all happened. So, GG, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.